guys, welcome back to the channel. My name's Cupquick. We're continuing some more Fran Bo. Last we left off, um, we need to figure out how to get into this hole, all right? The rat said that the cat make an entry is what it says. Make an entry, but how? Entry is like when you enter somewhere. So I have to enter this. Okay, so maybe I can use the key on the well. Sometimes things just don't work. Yeah, that doesn't work. I feel like I'm just gonna click everything in this pile. Cause I am missing something. Okay, now I feel like a dummy. We got the door. So now I think, okay, let's try combining this with the door. The handle won't stay on. So let's combine the door handle with the glue, then the door handle with the door. And now let's use that. Okay, we're using this in the dark world. I'm calling it the dark world. Uh, let's use it on the well. Okay, this is really odd. My own door is locked. Urgh. Okay, let's use the key. Golden key from the tree on the door. Use. There we go. Hooray! Oh, well, I don't know if I should be cheering because I'm going to the dark underworld. What a curious little door. Sounds like Alice in Wonderland. Or, but, I mean, we're going somewhere way darker than uh, Wonderland. So, Mr. Midnight, are you here? Oh gosh, someone's behind me. What the hell? It attached to my eye? Demons. Chapter two, part two, double personality. Okay, so I am crazy. Uh, oh, how pretty. Oh my goodness, where am I? What is this place? A hat. Mr. Midnight? Oh no, your head, kitty. That's not really his head, right? Wait a second, this is not my kitty. What a weird hat. Anyways, I have to find kitty. I hope you are here somewhere. Okay, what's this? Welcome home, beautiful kitten. We hope you like your new bed. Be nice and eat your food. Love, Clara and Mia. Well, there's my food. Um, it's fun to see how see what people have in their homes. Okay, so. Um, okay, I'm clicking everything. I just collected something. I'm clicking everything. It's a clicker game. Um, bottles of milk. Let's check the oven. A cooker. Let's look outside the window. Oh, we just closed it. All right. Mm, let's see if we can grab any of this stuff up here. Oh my gosh! This stuff is so cute. Cookies! Honey bear. Flour. Um, what is... Oh, baking soda. I got baking soda! And pine cones. Uh, okay. And a little handkerchief. Oh, we're taking the knife. Good, good. A spatula. Sounds like Dracula with a spa. Okay, and let's check out this picture. Mr. Midnight, those girls, they took my kitty. Firewood to keep the chimney warm. All right, let's, let's, let's take our happy pills and see what is really in this room. Oh, that's great. I'm in the well. I'm in the well with a bunch of dead babies. Uh, jeez, Fran. A secret bottle with a secret note inside? I'm very curious right now. What? That's not a secret bottle. Okay, I'm taking taking my happy pills again. It keeps me nice and happy, you know? Okay, so let's start over here on this edge. Oh my gosh, I have so many things. I have matches to light up the darkness. All right, good, good, good. Flowers. They don't smell. They must be plastic flowers then. Okay, um... I won't sit down. Okay, there's so much stuff up here. What can we take? Squirrel's body parts. Uh, kitties like to play with olives. Mm, garlic. Oh, pepper. 
Okay, I'm just taking random stuff. Oats and mush. This smells like a weed we had in our garden. Oh, we got salt. Salt and pepper. We're going to have to cook up something. I know it. It's not going to be good. The window's locked. Great. Okay, look at this bear. A dancing teddy. All right, let's see. Can we look in here? Where are we? Still in the well? Yep, still there. Just standing in the well. I am a creeper. I... I'm confused. Um, it's so cute though. Everything is so cute down here with all this wallpaper and stuff. I don't know if I'm really crazy. I don't want to be crazy, but you know, Fran. Uh, caramel sauce all over it. Okay, we can't take any of the cake. Let's look at this picture of these two girls. It looks like they're from The Shining. The twins from The Shining. It looks exactly like that. Their faces look familiar. Um, what about this? Pretty. Cute. A tiny house in the middle of nowhere. Are these ashes? A vase to put some flowers in. It has ashes inside. <laughs> well, okay. Alright, a fire. Cozy and warm. Um. Can we go upstairs? I don't know if we can. We're, we're exploring everything. Oh my gosh, guys. Ah, this is so demented. Okay. Uh, what about this broom? I got a broom. I'm getting so many things. I'm collecting so many things. Let's see what's inside. Candles to light up the darkness. The sisters, they look alike. They're twins. And why is this chain? Oh, well, I can go upstairs if I want. We'll save the attic for later because we all know guys this is so creepy imagine having something like this at your house a mirror but why is my reflection not there because you're crazy Fran it's a monster and so much blood okay a very old painting this is this creepy bed with a doll in here toys and look pluckers it looks like I could pick those up Yes, I can. Okay. Anything else? Okay, let's turn our happy pills on. I'm falling. I fell in the well again. Was I trying to climb? I am trying to climb out of here. Oh my gosh. Okay, can I get that bottle? Let's try to get this. I didn't know that I can climb this. Okay, I'm missing a brick. I'm gonna fall. She needs a bridge. What can we use? The broom. Yes! No! Darn it! Well, it's broken. All right, I don't know what else I can use. Let's, let's get out of here. Um, I'm back downstairs though. Okay, let's go upstairs. We're gonna go into the attic. What? I'm still gonna be in the well, so we're not gonna use our hoppy pills anymore. We're now in the creepy attic. Can we turn the light on? There we go. There we go. Oh gosh, oh my gosh, guys! Wow! It looks like it hurts. Don't cry, all right? Okay, okay, okay. I can't take that cry anymore. A buddy doll. What are you waiting for? Uh, and there's a cage. Are you here, kitty? And there's a lock. Oh my gosh. Meow? I'm here for you. Don't be scared. I'm here for you. Fran, is it really you? Oh dear, finally! Let me see you. Come closer. <gasps> Mr. Midnight! I'm so happy to see you. I missed you so very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you too. Mr. Midnight, and I really miss you. Oh, dear Fran, how did you find this place? After those people took you away in the woods, I tried to follow them, but after a while I got lost. My senses were too weak to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Someone took me and put me in this cage. I will open the cage. Uh, we need to get Aunt Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was just a bad dream. It's going to be fine. 
We just have to get out of here. What do you need? Sure. What do you need, Mr. Midnight? Are you hungry? I have cat food. Did you feel my presence in your dreams? Yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine and find you. What medicine, Fran? I wasn't really... It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt the presence of something else. A presence? Really? What kind of presence? For what I felt, it wasn't human, but it was really peaceful and kind. That's magic! Great to have somebody else taking care of his friend. Did you hear that? Did you? Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try to find a key and unlock you, all right? Oh, Mr. Midnight. And there are those uh, twins. They're probably the ones who live here. Okay. So let's see if I can collect anything. Oh, there's a dead rat. It's time to get up, Mr. Rat. All right. Is there anything that I can collect from this? Anything at all? Something. Okay. I don't think there's anything that I can get. I need a piece of wood. Oh, hello, little ghost. No big deal. No big deal. Nope. Nope. No. Oh, I'm gonna go back downstairs. <gasps> you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. There you are. We were waiting for you. Where is your head? My head? My head is just in its right place. You, the precious being from the other world. Who would ever believe us? I'm confused. Now, ladies, what are you talking about? Franbo. That's your name, right? And your mom and dad died tragically, very brutally, right? And now you really want to know who killed them, right? How do you know? Slow down. How is it that you know all this? We just know. We have to. We are part of this world. But don't be scared. Don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us all the time. I feel lost. I wish nothing bad had happened to me. I feel completely lost. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. They won't come back. I can't see solutions. The pain I feel is so great, I can't see. Drink some tea and eat some cake. It will make you feel better. Who told you about me? Are you scared, little friend? I am confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd for a girl who loves her cat more than anything else in the world. And yet you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling in fear of you? I'm not calm. I love him! And that is why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? Hello? He's my best friend. Before we set him free, tell us about how it is you came here. It's a long story. I escaped from a place, a very ugly place. They open the heads of children and find out what's wrong with them. Phil told me a secret and I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came into the woods and met a giant ant. And I killed a bug and it was terrible. And then I met a rat who wanted to get his hair done. And then I made a door. And that door took me here. But when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything else, and I saw a real pinecone family that was before I came here. They lived at Mr. Antonio's house. They liked berries. Okay, we're just telling our stories. Uh, also in the woods. That was some adventure. How old are you, Fran? I am 10 years old. We're 16 years old, much older than you, so you have to obey us. You can't tell me what to do. Open the cage. I just wish you would open the cage so I can go home with my kitty. You haven't asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander around in this house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all? I'm not stupid. And I do have a family. I have Aunt Grace and my kitten. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly as we say, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? Whatever you need. Now listen to us carefully. Okay, what? 
We need you to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Magic is magical. Who doesn't like magic? Uh, this magic is very powerful. It's tremendous and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be cautious and precise. Otherwise, terrible things can happen. Summon the old what? Don't know if I can. We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. We used to be two different people in two different bodies. Um, but how? One night a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. We thought it was an angel, but it was not. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We have a spell to bring him back, but we will do that later. Okay. Yeah, okay, I'll try my best. All right, we're gonna go gather some things. Um, we're gonna go gather some things you will need for the ritual, okay. In the meantime, you can go and talk to your cat, but we won't see him sem free yet. All right, I'll be waiting. Oh, they have a key. Do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you? You silly, silly girl. Ma, ma. Ma, 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 ma. Okay. Can I eat some cupcakes? I want to eat some cake. All right. So they went this way. Um, uh, the smell. Oh my gosh, guys. This is terrible. Look. Jen. Jen. Jazz Antonio the Greatest. Wow. He has a volumes one and two, the blueberry tree. Can we play? Can we? Jance. Okay. A typewriter. Let's see. Is this Owl Real? No, it's not. Can I grab anything from this place? I don't think I can. Okay. Um, I'm going to go upstairs. And we are... Look, it's Mr. Midnight. We're going to go upstairs. They end up in a wall? I can't go up there. Okay. All right. Let's go this way. See what else we need. Well, hello there. It's him again, but I haven't taken my pill. I can't take my pill anymore. Well, he opened the window. Thank you, but who is he? Oh, hello, Mr. Toad. Just random. Hello, I can talk to him. Hey, you. Yes, who's speaking? Me, I'm a toad. I have to tell you something. What is it? You are in great danger. Don't trust the girls. Why do you say that? Look, girl, I'm a toad. And I, I can swim away from this place. But they won't let me. Every time I try to get out here, I magically come back. This house is like a huge magnet. A toad and a cat magnet. They love us, but not to give us love, just to use us. Don't trust them. That's terrible. That's why my kitty's here then. They gave you a recipe for some kind of magic, right? How did you know? Did you see the dead girl in the one of the rooms? Yes, I did. Well, that can be you if you try to do it. She tried, but she did it wrong. What should I do? I'm not a clever toad, but if I were you, I would be creative. I'll try my best. Okay, please save us all. I really want to get out of here. Okay, Mr. Toad. I think this was the house that we saw um, in the picture. The one that's on the little island. Can I put these fake flowers in my vase with the ashes? Okay, so I am still looking for an item to use. Let's look at this recipe. Let's examine this. Summon the old lost body. Lost in darkness, lost in tears, your body becomes a lie through the hand of the one angel that decides to bring you sorrow. 
The heart of a frog. Head of a young virgin. That's probably me. Hair and blood from a black cat. A pentagram made of ashes. And the burnt body of a fox. Okay. This must be cooked all together inside a pot or cauldron with plenty of water. When you are about to drink the potion, repeat these words. Manambu. Oh, geez. I'm scared to read this. I'm scared to read that, guys. I don't want to summon anything. Mm -mm. Nope, nope. Nope, not going to read it. Okay, I need to find something. Like, what? What is? what are these baking soda, salt and pepper for? I feel like I'm cooking something. Ashes, candle, wax, and tongs. I have so many things in my inventory. Okay, guys. Uh, I have no idea what to do. I'm gonna go talk to my kitty cat. Let's go talk to my kitty cat. See how he's doing up there. Hey, hey. Did you get the key? Okay, I need to tell you the bad news. Not yet. Sorry, those girls are scary. They just want to utilize me. They cut hair from me and took some blood. It's for the recipe. I think they're witches, wicked witches. You know, like in the stories we read. You're right. They are witches. What did those girls tell you? They told me they weren't attached to each other before and that they will get revenge against the one who did this to them. And they also showed me a key. I'm pretty sure it's for the cage. They have the evil inside. I mean, maybe that's uh, someone had its reasons. Evil against evil. Evil against evil. I'll have to fight evil with evil. There must be something, something that they are really afraid of. I don't know. I'll see what I can find. See you soon, my dears. What about these babies? They're scared of this baby. I'm scared of those babies. Really scared of those babies. Stop it. Stop crying, you big babies. Okay, guys. I still have no idea how to get out of the well. Um, maybe if I take the happy pill over here. What? Does that do anything? Woo! Nope. Doesn't do anything. I seriously need to get over there, though. I don't know how I'm going to do it. No idea how I'm going to do that. I feel like I need that now. Can I throw my knife and cut the rope? No. There's nothing I have here that's going to help. But, all right, guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. We'll see what happens in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. My name is Cupquake, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Peace. Uh